What up YouTube, Lamont at large, YouTube's most wanted. Today, I'm in East Baton Rouge, Louisiana. I am walking along Dyer Road. Behind me is the Comite River. And I'm here to talk about the June 1982 unsolved murders of Deborah Hortense and Archie Hooper. The last time 24-year-old Archie Hooper and 28-year-old Deborah Hortense Goodspeed were seen alive was on the very early morning hours of June 13, 1982. They were at a bar having drinks over on Plank Road at a bar called The Game Room and Pub. After the bar had closed, uh, there was a party somewhere in this area, and they went to go join their friends to have... I guess a late night party, if you will. You imagine the summer of 1982 out here could be quite hot and humid. So after the party broke up, everybody went their own separate ways. And Archie and Deborah, they had told their friends that they were going to stay and have a swim in this lake right here. We're going to go down here and uh, go through the trees and investigate the scene of the crime. The next morning, Deborah nor Archie were heard from by their friends and their family members got worried and called the police. They were missing for several days until the following day on the 16th, nearly three days after they were last seen, some guys running some trot lines out here in this very section uh, found the very badly decomposing bodies of Archie Hooper and Deborah Hortense Goodspeed. Quickly, the East Sheriff's Office of Baton Rouge sectioned off the crime scene and their bodies were taken down to the medical examiner's office to have an autopsy done. After the autopsies were completed, it was found that Deborah and Archie were both shot in the back of the head. And before Archie was killed, he was severely beaten. They had found Archie's 4x4 truck on one side of the river right here and their bodies on the other. There was no blood evidence seen anywhere near the truck. They were both found nude and their clothes were in Archie's truck. As I said earlier, 1.30 in the morning in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, it's still going to be 75 degrees out here. So it's easy to say after a night of drinking and having a good time, they probably were both really hot and decided to go skinny dipping in this very river right here. After subsequent interviews with the family and friends of Archie and Deborah, no motive at all was found for this unsolved double murder. There was no known, known serious uh, uh, adversaries or enemies of Archie or Deborah. And whoever committed this double murder, either they didn't tell anybody or whoever was involved, everybody just pretty much kept their mouth shut. And this is about the scene where their bodies were found. You got almost 40 years later, and this uh, double murder uh, remains to be uh, unsolved. If anybody has any information on this unsolved double homicide, please call Baton Rouge Crime Stoppers, 225-344-STOP. That's 225-344-7867. You might be eligible for a cash reward. I am Lamont at Large. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next vlog. Peace out.